All right, we are on Thompson House. We are playing Pinhead by, not by request, but we are playing Perkless by request, as you can see. We are running strong add-ons with Pinhead to try to have... Magoon? Where are you going, Magoon? Where are you going, Magoon? You have balance? She's got balance. Of course she does. And that, by the way, that still doesn't get us to the... Still did not get us the down. Oh, I'll take this, though. That's gonna help. Meg, I don't know if you were leading me to the box, or if it just worked out that way, but I'm not gonna complain. We've lost one gen, that's not really a surprise. I guess my question is, do we already start thinking about a three gen? and what gens we want to consider protecting. We're looking for the ace. He's the one who's got the box. Wait, is he in the basement? He's not in the basement, but he's... Ace, you're not solving that in time, buddy. Ace, you might not have been in the basement before, but that's where you're going to be now. All right. That's right, we picked up the box here. Survivors were over there, so box is either in that corner or in this corner, probably in that one. Because it's gonna spawn further away from us. It's interesting. Magoon, where are you going with my box? Oh, that's so sad. That is so sad, Magoon. Magoon, that is so sad. Yeah, we just screwed that up. We know she is balanced. I don't care. We're going to let her go. Yeah, they're over here. Dwight! So this is not efficient for a perkless round. Our best chance to win this round would probably be to go ahead and get somebody out of the match as soon as we could. We're not doing that. And in fact, we're over by an area where there are no gens. So we got it down, but what cost? All right, Meg and Ace, we both have a hook on, so we want them.
We definitely want them over the knee. Uh. All right. Oh, well, somebody is dead in the basement and we found our box. Well, I was gonna kick the Gen A's, but I guess we'll just try to kill you instead. Second hook for Ace. I think Meg's gonna die over there. The box. You opened it. I came. Ah! Nia, you have balance too? Oh, you're a Nia. Of course you do. Do they use a hatch offering? Guess it doesn't matter, does it? I believe it would not matter, Nia. What a waste of good suffering. I'm gonna disagree. I feel like this was not a waste of good suffering. I believe all the suffering that was necessary worked out fine. All right, let's kick the gen for our challenge. So, box logic. Oh. That will do it. That is a 4K. That is a 4K. And that is Perkless Pyramid. Pyramid Head. Perkless Pinhead. And uh, how did we do, Perkless? I think we did pretty well. Uh, we landed some of our chains. Now, we still need practice. We still need work on being able to land our our, our chains of torment. Uh, we miss too often. But when we're able to land it, like, we nailed the Meg over by that pallet, and then the Meg, like, was trying to break the chains. But she's a console player, so the key bindings, we played Survivor. That just made her vault the pallet back towards us. And we were able to get an easy down. So we kind of, unfortunately, uh, were the beneficiaries, unfortunately for the Meg, the beneficiaries of poor key binding by the developers for console players. Uh, but we did land the chain. And sometimes we can't even land those close ones. But we did land chains a couple of times. Uh, a couple of times it didn't get us the hits we wanted. Other times, like in the case of that Meg, it did. Uh, what we did do was we found our box multiple times or got... We found it in the beginning of the match when we were chasing the Meg, and then we found it, uh, at least found the survivors with the box who weren't able to solve it. Ace being by the killer shack was one, and then at that point, everything just kind of snowballed from there. We, uh, we hooked Dwight in the basement. Nobody was coming for him. He died on one hook. Sorry, Dwight, but uh, it's not like we were camping you. We were nowhere in the vicinity. Uh, we mainly focused on the Meg and the Ace throughout the course of that match. We kind of, you kind of have to do that if you're running perkless. We had nothing to slow the gens down, but in the end, they only got, I think, a couple gens. Uh, that iridescent lament configuration. The box was their secondary objective. It's what kept us in the match. The chain hunts kept us in the match, and we just got enough pressure with that. Uh, Nia, what was that? A commodious brand new part, mechanics brand new part. Uh, uh, nothing really spectacular anywhere other than that. Uh, Nia didn't have balance, but we knew the Meg did. Uh, uh, Nia had lithe, so what we saw, th what we thought was balance, was her running with lithe. Um, in the end, I, even Perkless, Pinhead is a really, really, really strong killer. If you know how to use him, we might not be the best Pinhead, but this combination of add-ons is stupidly good. And in this case, chain hunts, the box, 
the add-ons, all of that combining to do enough pressure to give us a 4K on Thompson House with Pinhead by request.